What's going on, Clutch? Squat! What up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Dub. It's your boy, Ross. We're in the Clutch. Hey. Back. Get you, ladies and gentlemen, another visitor that you feel me. Funny WWE wrestlers, secret. Uh, I said secret. I don't know where that came from. Scenes in movies. Yeah, man. You know, <laughs> some of your favorites. Uh, have mm -hmm. been in movies, a lot of them. Mm -hmm. I yeah. even know about have been in movie scenes. So we're gonna see which funny ones, uh, which ones were funny, which movies were funny that they were in. <laughs> okay, man. We get it, dog. <laughs> All right, let's check this out. We know no, no, Mr. Cena. You Can't See Me, man. He gonna be in there. Take a WWE wrestler and put him in front of a camera and you get comedy gold. Just say f you. Yeah. I will you all right i will enter you you're gonna, you're gonna enter me you hear what he said this clip is gonna sound kind of gay hey. but it's really funny <laughs> Fucking wild. i didn't even know this happened <laughs> hey yo <laughs> well Boy. that's the clip that's the video we can cut it off right now what is going on here, bro? Look at the way he's looking into his eyes. Oh, bro, we gotta me. go back. Excuse me. Oh my we only god! Few seconds in. Oh god! We what? only a few seconds in. That's this wild, is, bro. This is what's happening. <laughs> gotcha. WWD back in the day. <laughs> you just had to rope me up. I ain't doing that. Whoever. Oh, that is wild, bro. The 2010 film McGruber is about a former Navy SEAL named McGruber. At the start of the movie, That's McGruber is called into action and he's tasked with building his team. Uh, One of the men hearing. McGruber asked to join him is Chris Jericho. But once the two get together, it gets a little awkward. Looks like you're keeping your bod pretty tight. You're looking pretty good yourself. Well, every day's a workout when you gotta carry around a 20 pound python in your jeans. You and your dick comments. It's fun to say them. It's fun to hear them. That's why I say them. And that's why I listen. What? Triple H may not have had the movie career of The Rock or John Cena, but he's had some pretty funny scenes. Come on. Oh. Then it better be your fanny pack. Hey, yo. Yo, bro, why everything gotta be so... Why do I get the feeling that wasn't a fanny pack? It's However, weird. this clip from Blade 3 is yeah, probably the best. Yeah, I forgot he was Just in Blade watch. 3, Oh, bro. yeah, that's true. He was in Blade 3. <laughs> That is very true. He was in Blade. Oh, ah. The, the dripped off fame. That's funny, bruh. <laughs> Pressure's in me. Well, that depends who you ask, because clearly this riddles. dog has a bigger than you. And when the f did you see my face? Ow! I was talking to her! The Undertaker and Funny usually don't belong in the same sentence, but they do when you watch this clip. The movie Suburban Commando stars Hulk Hogan as a space warrior named Ramsey. Hogan has to hide out on Earth while his ship gets fixed. However, two bounty hide hunters out. are tasked with hunting down and destroying the Hulkster. What? One of the bounty hunters is played wow. by The Undertaker, but we don't get to hear him speak, and there's a good reason for that. Eventually, the dead man and the immortal one battle it out. Even though they aren't in the ring, the two still managed to hit some wrestling moves. Wow, Finally, The Undertaker tells that. Hogan, who's boss, but it's not what you would expect. You're a dead man, Ramsey. No wonder you guys never talk. Being oh, in. Did he really they put the voice oh, over? This. Oh, God. Man, these movies had budgets. Yep. Think about this here. They had budgets. I never knew that. That me neither. That's that's one of those uh, little factoids. I never knew Undertaker played in a movie. What? Like that. I just found that out, man. So hey, man. Yeah, hey, I, I I can uh, appreciate these type of videos giving you some factoids, man. So many movies. The Rock has a countless amount of funny scenes. Of course. Hey, Mia, you better hide your baby, all. I'm just playing. <laughs> you better hide that big ass forehead. <laughs> oh, that was a joke. I One of the funniest is from the 2010 film <laughs> The Other Guys. In the movie, The Rock, as well as Samuel L. Jackson. This is a very dumb <laughs> movie, bro. Hey, for the bushes. You already know, partner. Uh, there goes my hero. <laughs> Splat. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> that shit will never not be funny. Cause I'm thinking, are oh, these niggas really about to land in some wet bushes? These niggas die. They land in some bushes, I. Right. Of the oh, that was so funny, man. Jackson uh. are two cocky detectives. <laughs> While chasing after some bad guys, the two realize they need to jump from a tall building in order to catch them. What happens next is priceless. You thinking what I'm thinking, part? <laughs> Aim for the bushes. Yeah. Let's go. There goes my hero. 
After hanging up his wrestling boots, like, Batista why? dove headfirst into acting. His big mm -hmm. breakout role oh, yeah. was, of course, Drax from Guardians of the Galaxy. Yeah. Drax has some of the funniest too. lines, not just in Guardians, but in the entire Marvel Cinematic oh, Universe. Facts. For sure. Where is Gamora? Yeah, I'll do you one better. Who's Who is Gamora? Gamora? I'll do you one better. Why is Gamora? <laughs> that was hilarious. Mantis, look out! I am hideous? You are horrifying to look at, yes. But that's a good thing. Oh? When you're ugly and someone loves you, you know they love you for who you are. His people are completely literal. Metaphors are gonna go over his head. Nothing goes, goes over, over my head. head. My reflexes are too fast. <laughs> I would catch it. This next scene is really inappropriate, Idiot. but that's what makes it so funny. In the horror comedy film, A Haunted House 2, the main character, Malcolm, starts experiencing all sorts of supernatural stuff. He eventually contacts a paranormal psychologist professor to help him out. During one of their conversations, the professor's locked behind bars, leading to an unexpected, but very funny WWE cameo. If you need to hang up that computer call, come oh, and kiss me on my hot mouth. I'm feeling romantical. I don't mean dog. I didn't, I didn't even know, know that he was in that I movie. Didn't dog. even know that, bro. Shout out to Mark, man. Shout out to Mark, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's wild, bro. Just take me out, bro. <laughs> Just, <laughs> Just trying to commit more crimes than being solitary. <laughs> Oh. oh man. He push you, but anyway, you can do that before you get raped. What part of Mandingo party do you not understand? Oh. It's time to pile on the white rap, you know. Ugh. Dirty to snow. <laughs> I'm screwed. In WWE, fans really only got to see oh, one side of Andre the Giant. However, in the cult classic film, The Princess Bride, audiences got to witness Andre's comedic chops as the character, Fezzik. Here we go. I sit at the princess table, and there they were, four white horses. And I thought, there are four of us. If we ever find the lady, hello, lady. Wait. What? However, I think this line from Andre what? is the funny. What was he in? Uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute, bro. Hold on, bro. Are we insinuating what I think we insinuating here? He saw the princess table. I saw the princess table. And there they were. Four white, white horses. horses. And I thought, there are four, four of us. us. If we ever find the lady. Hello, lady. However, I... Movies were different back then. Yeah, they're way different, You bro. can get away with saying some of the wildest way shit. Way different, bro. <laughs> And people were just like laughing. Oh, that's funny. <laughs> wow, bro, that's crazy. The more we look back. The more we look back. The more we find out. I think this line from Andre is the funniest. Fezzik, are there rocks ahead? If they are, we all be dead. No more rhymes now, I mean it. Anybody want a peanut? Yeah! In the 2019 movie Changeland, two friends travel through Thailand. In one scene, they end up at a bar, and guess who they bump into? <laughs> For these guys, <laughs> us? Yeah, you. What the hell are you doing in this bar? I got a shot in your hand. Shot for everybody! <laughs> they thought they were about to be killed. I seriously thought Randy Orton was gonna give them an RKO. Okay, yeah. right. Long before he became a full-time actor, John Cena was guest starring in the Fred movies. Uh -huh. Sure, they aren't high art, but come yeah, on. He was. Luckily, in the final minutes, you sent us a transmission. Check it out, it's right there. However, I think Cena's funniest role <laughs> has to be as the DC of superhero, course, yeah. Peacemaker. Yeah. Oh. Yes. You're that racist superhero. Oh. You only kill minorities, man. <laughs> I've killed a fair amount of white people, too. The ratio is suspect is all I have to say. Okay, this next <laughs> scene is kind of mean, but really funny. In one of his earliest movie appearances, the Big Show appears in the Adam Sandler film, The Water Boy. In the movie, mm, the Big Show plays wow. a yeah. wrestler named Captain Insano. Adam That's Sandler's insano. character, a socially inept water boy, calls the wrestler and asks if the Big Show needs his services. Mm -hmm. The giant's reaction Classic. is hilarious. Mm -hmm. How old are you, kid? 11, 12? I, I am 31 years old. <laughs> <laughs> Love this movie, bro. Yeah. I guarantee that guy's still a virgin. When you think of funny That's wrestlers, you don't funny. usually think of Sting. Well, unless he's Joker Sting. 
Remember, the only thing is for sure about Sting. Ah, oh, never mind. However, the Stinger had a brief but funny scene in the movie Ready to Rumble. In the climax of the film, Sting helps out the main characters, Gordy and Sean, by aiding Jimmy King in the giant cage match. After helping them out, the boys say this to the icon. You love Jimmy King. I love Jimmy King. We're men, and we're not afraid to say that we love other men. <laughs> I love you. What? <laughs> <laughs> me too, man. Hit me, hit me, my turn! Oh. Also, in the same scene, Diamond Dell's Paige has a pretty funny moment, too. Paige! You idiot! That stuff doesn't work! What the? Look, the diamond upside down is a pussy! <laughs> a lot of men can relate to this. In the 2008 movie Get Smart, two secret agents, played by Steve Carell and Anne Hathaway, destroy a weapons factory. As they try to escape, they're confronted by the great Khali. Wow. The agents are no match for the former world champion, so Steve Carell's character tries a different approach. And it's pretty funny. Your marriage is in trouble. Your darling wife's not that's leaving you. But there's still hope. Do you love her? She just wants to be with you, and frankly, that means less time with her sister, who we both know is undermining your relationship. What, what, what are you doing? What? Oh. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Hug him. Such a bitch. I know, in-laws are the worst. Also, this scene is pretty good, too. <laughs> Did you know that Bray Wyatt appeared in the animated Dare Everyone Be Kid movie? To see that, watch this video. I didn't video. know that, man. Oh, it didn't know that at all, man. Wow. Hey, this was a good one, man. This was. <laughs> <laughs> he appeared. <laughs> Joey and Jake. Right. This is out of nowhere. But he nah, this was, this was definitely a dope one. Found out some uh, different uh, factoids I didn't know about certain wrestlers being mm -hmm. in movies, man. So. Yeah, nah. Nah, that's awesome. No, that for sure. Yeah, yeah, no, for sure. If y'all wanted to check out some more of these, make sure you know what to do. Make sure you want to like, subscribe, let us know what else we need to be checking out, man. Keep on supporting us, spreading love, being love. And we'll catch you in the next one. Peace out. Peace. This bitch is from Houston. If you got a problem, then we got the solutions. And there's no illusion. I made this shit happen. I'm living life lucid. I'm switching my strategies. Now they hate on me because I'm causing casualties. So why are they after me? Deep inside they know they can't handle half of me